Now this is the bracket that goes on a piece of machinery. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this right down through here to simulate a break. Okay, now cut it in two and you can see I've kind of ground this down a little bit. But if I set it right here and either weld it or braze it together, the heat is going to change the position slightly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it in a vise. Now I've got it mounted in the vise so that it's going to stay in position. And I'm just going to tack weld it. And I'm using a 1 16th inch RG45 gas welding rod. Doing both pieces. So they just go beyond red hot and starting to melt. And just a little tack weld. That's enough to hold it in position. And I'm going to weld it from the back. And how well welded it needs to be depends upon how much pressure or stress it's going to be under. I'm just coming right up here. I could have also brazed this. Just working that weld right in there. Okay, let that cool. Coming around to the front. That is warm. Now, this bottom lip right here. Just getting both sides of the bracket so it's beginning to melt. And then melting the gas welding rod right down in there. So in other words, this piece of steel is melding, this piece of steel is melding, and this rod is melding all at the same time. So when they cool, they're fused together, so it's all one metal. All right. So now all I have to do is to grind this and then give it a coat of paint. Well, a little work with a four inch grinder and we're back in business here. Beats going out and trying to find another one.